Okay, so in this session, we're going to create a poster using Bizart. I'm not going to use the stock ones. I'm going to bring my own in. So here's a picture um, for a project I'm doing around creating food. So I'm going to use this picture here. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn this into a little poster. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to remove the background. There we go. So that's done a really good job. Obviously, she stood behind a table. So there's a slant. So I'm just going to move her down there and then just move her across so she fits completely within the frame. Here we go. And what we're going to do now is we're just going to look at different options for the background. So I'm just going to slide across at the bottom. What do we have here? I mean, there are so many guys that it would take just a week for me to show you every one. So I'm not going to do that. I just want to give you a quick overview and to empower you so you guys know how to do this and you've got the confidence to try this for yourselves. Okay, so let's have a look in here. And again, there are so many options. Okay, so that's interesting. I mean, these are all really great and depending on the style of poster you want to make, obviously you'll have a background that fits that purpose. For me, this is a cooking show that we're making, so I just want something that fits in with the idea and themes of what this is. So we'll keep this one for now, I think. Okay, let's get some text in there. So we're gonna call this Cooking with Steph. Okay, we have a look here. There we go, with Steph. Oh, that's not how you spell Steph. So let me just check that spell check there. So great thing about Bazaar is it will tell me if it's spelled wrong. There we go. Okay, so that's what the show's called. And this is with a company called Dazzle. So we're just going to rearrange the text here right now. Excellent. So we'll just move that up to the top corner. Just play with the scale a little bit. Maybe we'll change the color. There we go. And I don't want to um, copy or delete. So I'm just going to change the color. And it's the simplest tapping it at the bottom. That Obviously, that doesn't work because we can't see it. Let's go to classic white. Perfect. There we go. And guys, it's as simple as that. Super easy, super simple poster. The final things I want to do now is let me just have a look at the creating a little bit of shadow for our text to make it pop from the background. So that looks really good. And maybe we should add a little bit of light leak. So let's go to our overlays and I'll just go to light leak. And again, this is super, super quick. We'll just pop something on there to give it quite a nice jazzy vibe. I'll just move that across there. Here we go, play with the size a little bit. Great, is there any more that I like? That's quite interesting. So I'm just going through scrolling, having a play, seeing one that we like. So guys, that's it, it's that simple. Create your poster, click the export, top right corner, and you're done. Super simple, super easy, okay. I shall see you guys in the next session where we're going to look at more editing apps.